Starting this Camaro for the first time. I mean, the interior is nice, but let's see what it sounds like. Oh my God. This is insanity. All right, this is gonna be a fun day. Drives like a dream. The interior is prim and perfect. What's up, guys? It's Cole, Colin. How's it going? Out here doing a little, uh, little show and go on this ins insane 1970 Camaro. Colin's gonna give you guys the rundown. What's up, guys? Long time no see. As you see, an iconic split bumper 1970s Camaro. Some people may imitate it. Spot the real one where you see it. Now, this one isn't your ordinary little 350 or 396 that may have came with it. What we do have behind here is a modern Corvette LS1, complete with a BBK intake manifold and a few other small upgrades. That right there is vintage eight, um, is a modern air conditioning from Vintage Air, full, fully redone. It's got a Ram Air intake, full coilover suspension, freshly, freshly redone. It's beautiful. With the Cortez Silver, the US mag wheels, and them stripes, it's exactly what you want. It's just missing a few little more things. We're probably gonna do a front lip, and that's probably about it for the body. It's breathtaking by itself. Look, as someone who's grown up around cars, doesn't really know them that well, this thing is nuts. This thing is, this thing is nuts. It's, it's, it's nuts. Like, you go to the interior, right? It's flawless. There isn't a stitch out of place. The carpets are perfect. Shifts like a dream. Like you, you really couldn't ask for more. Oh, hey, say what's up to yourselves. <laughs> Shout out to all of you. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. But yeah, I mean, it's, it is, it's just insane. It's insane. All right, let's hear what this thing sounds like on the inside. Say when. Just any V8. That's a Corvette LS1 with T56. Insane. Like 12 volt out back. Not bad, huh? I was just telling yourselves over there. Not bad for a little 5.7 uh, LS1 with a T56 and a 12 volt. Holy crap! This thing's probably got about 450 horsepower. That could be easily made up to about 5 600 with the right mods. What's up, y'all? It's hot as shit outside. Oh my god. Solid like. 95. Big guy Humid. In a little car. Sweaty. But you know what? It's fun time. It's play time. <laughs> listen. Just listen. Give it a give it a lull. <laughs> I don't want to go to jail today, so let's hope that doesn't happen. Yeah, we're not going to jail, let's be honest. This thing is sick. Yeah I man. The the coilovers and the suspension, they dialed it in just right for that awesome look and roll. And also going around curves, it's not, it'll, it's most muscle cars typically like to go fast in a straight line. This one you can do anything with. You can take it on cur curvy roads, mountain roads, autocross, whatever you want. And it's got the right stance too. When I tell you guys this thing literally, literally, literally drives like a modern car, it, keep it, it's 50 years old. This car is 50, it's more, it's double my age. And it drives like it just came off the lot yesterday. We just passed a 2016 SS and the guy's jaw dropped saying, oh, I want to trade mine in and get me one of these. Jealousy is a bad trait to have.
still have a nice little rumble out the back, but you know, if you really wanted to, you could use this as a daily driver car. It's got all the amenities, kick-ass stereo, very, very, very cold AC from Vintage Area, like I mentioned earlier. I mean, if you want to have a badass looking car that no one else has on the road, and you can still use it as a daily driver, this is it. And we missed the pothole. <laughs> Holy shit. Hey, you look like that uh, little uh, blow dryer Almost action there. I fell out of the car like three times. <laughs> we're just, you know, we're out here cruising on the back roads, just, you know, driving around. Not only is this thing glued to the road, it takes turns like a Porsche. It accelerates like a Corvette. Well, it is a Corvette, just in a Camaro body. <laughs> I know what you What more could you want in a classic car? This thing is perfect. And you're never going to see another one on the street that's built like this either. You just won't. You just won't. But, if you like, comment, and subscribe, you'll see a whole lot of other s*** we got. This is true. Late time is fun time. Yes, but stay tuned for this one. Tell my boss. Sorry. Yeah. Sorry, Dad. I love you to death, but we gotta do it for the people. Yes, sir. Do it for the content. Uh-huh. So, yeah. Oh, you hear that little Thanks for riding right along today, guys. I'm hot. I'm sweaty. I need air conditioning. Stay tuned because we're gonna be doing a hell of a lot more of these.